The current project that Laura and I, and I are working on is a research project that's looking at the impacts of the post pandemic on farmers and food processors in Algoma District. The benefits of hosting a student for groups like RAIN is that we have multiple projects every year and some projects that we don't have time to really focus on. And so this sort of partnership enables us to be doing more research in our work and it frees up staff resources uh, to focus in other areas and in our program delivery. I would encourage other organizations to host a field student uh, just for the different perspectives uh, that we get in our work from a student's perspective that's looking at issues differently from what they're learning in current theories around um, not just agri-food uh, systems, uh, but also in economic development and in uh, social innovation. I really liked how multidisciplinary it was and it really kind of went hand in hand with my previous degree in sustainable agriculture from Trent. Uh, the field placement project that I'm working on currently um, is with the Rural Agri-Innovation Network of Algoma and we are conducting a research study to learn about the emerging economic impacts that COVID-19 has had on the agri-food sector. I feel like this field placement has really kind of helped prepare me for the whole life after university. So I've really been learning how to like work within a professional network, how to meet deadlines, how to um, cooperate with other people within the workplace. That's what I've really been focusing on with this research project is making sure that the project that we're doing is relevant to the people that we're working with and to make sure that we're actually doing something worthwhile and helping to get them the supports they need. The CESD program has done a lot to enrich my worldviews in terms of how um, our economic systems and our social systems all kind of work together and intersect. It's helped me to broaden my worldviews. Field placements are critical for uh, the Community Economic and Social Development Program. It's the time that we are able to bring theory together with practice where students can explore through lived experience, through experiences at organizations, with communities, through activist projects, through all sorts of uh, applied experiences. We more learn from what happens on the ground in organizations, um, with individuals, uh, families, communities, uh, sometimes institutions, how community development um, unfolds and how we can theorize then about that from the lived experience of people.